Lisa Prado, and today my friend, an amazing makeup artist, Linda, Miss Union, is going to teach Nicole and I how to do a holiday glam look like the one that you see right now, utilizing my Rizos Curls and Smashbox Glow Getter Beauty Box from the Hefa Collection. So right here, if y'all want to achieve this look, keep watching. Hi guys, welcome. Today we are going to be learning a holiday glam look to go from the kitchen to the sala. Or from the room <laughs> to the dining room, okay? <laughs> For our holiday glam look, today we are gonna be using everything in the glow getter kit. Yes, so so excited to use this today. Let's get started. So skin prep is gonna be the most important part of starting makeup. It's super, super important that we're hydrating the skin, that we're nourishing the skin. We went in with a little bit of some gold action under the eyes to help hydrate the eyes. And now we are going to go into our Smashbox primer. Love, love, love this guy. This is gonna be the Vitamin Glow Primer. It's a serum slash primer. So um, at the same time that it's helping um, prolong the wear of your foundation and adding to that extra glow to the skin. One pump of this is enough. Always start with less is more and then you can always build. Um, you are going to apply this guy. This is gonna plump the skin, nourish the skin. It's got vitamin C, B, E, and it's gonna really help plump the skin, prepare the skin for the makeup. Next, going to go in with your favorite foundation. Today, I'm gonna be using a tinted moisturizer. I'm using the Smashbox Halo Tinted Moisturizer Healthy Glow All-in-One. I love to apply this with the fingers. You can also use a brush. Um, I think our fingers are our best tools, especially with a tinted moisturizer. I think it really nicely melts it into the skin. I love applying this product with my fingers. Any of my tinted moisturizers, I love applying with the fingers. The fingers are the best tools. You can also use a brush, a sponge to add a little bit more coverage. Um, it's a beautiful, beautiful product that you can definitely build. Okay, so we're starting off with the Cali Contour Palette. And this is beautiful to use on the face, but also to use on the eyes. We're gonna start off with the matte highlight down here at the bottom right corner. And we're just gonna just sweep this over the eyes just a little bit to kind of create a blank canvas for us to work on. And we're gonna go through both eyes, just a touch of that after you've primed your lids. So next up, we're gonna be going into the matte bronzer shade. And we're gonna take that with a fluffy brush, a little bit of that tap off, ladies, so that we don't get all that excess product on the rest of the face. And we are gonna pull the head back, looking down into the mirror, and you are gonna place this right in this crease area. So next up, we're gonna be going into the matte highlight. We're going back into that guy, and I'm picking up a little bit of that guy. We are gonna place that right under the brow bone right through there. After that, we're gonna go into our clean blending brush, and this is what we are gonna use to merge these two worlds together. So we're pretty much going right in between that line and just softening it, and we're using little circular motions, always, always still going in that half moon type shape. Same thing on the other eye. And this is a very natural eye that can be really built up if you want a little bit more drama. Next step, we're gonna be doing um, a little bit of a shimmer through the center of the eye. This is what really creates the halo eye and we're gonna be using the Smashbox Halo Glow Highlighter Duo. We're using the powder portion because it has a putty but it also has a powder and this is the Golden Bronze Powder. So I'm gonna pick that up with my finger we're just gonna do a little strip down the middle of the eye. Don't pass the crease. So let me show y'all right through the center. And blend. And just slightly blend. We're keeping this right in the center. You can grab a clean finger and just soften the edges. But you want that intensity of that glow through the center. Did I do this right? Let me see. Yes, beautiful. We're using one finger to apply and then we're using another one to blend in. Can I see your eyes? Yeah. Okay, wonderful. Let me do this. 
And what's great about this Smashbox Halo Highlighter Duo is that it goes beautiful on all skin tones. You could see on Julie, it looks really, really gorgeous on my eye and then beautiful, beautiful, beautiful on her eye. We went in and we took it, she took it through the whole eye. I took it more through the center and then Julie did a little bit of both. Okay, so next up we went in with a little bit of your favorite eyeliner. You could be a little bit more dramatic. I kept it a little bit low-key today. So after you've gone in with a little bit of eyeliner action, you could go into the matte contour. And I'm going to apply a little bit of that through the bottom of the eye. And I'm just running this right under that lash line just to help define a little bit more. I'm picking up a little bit more of that. And then we are applying this to the rest of the eye. So now we're gonna go into contouring the rest of the skin. We're gonna go into our Cali Contour Palette. I'm gonna use a little bit of that matte contour color. We're just gonna take a touch of that through the hollows of our cheeks, a little bit on the areas where we want to create a little bit more structure. So normally the contour is going to be a little bit of a grayish tint. This is what really gives that structure. So I'm applying a little bit of that through this area, just a touch of that through this forehead area on the sides, and then a touch of that through right under the jawline. And repeat that same thing to the rest of the face. You don't have to go crazy with this contour color. This is just creating those little shadows so that when I come in with that bronzer, which is meant to warm up that gray shadow, it's just going to amp it up. So with the contour, we're just using it very minimally throughout the face. Now I'm gonna go into that bronzer color, this matte bronzer. Beautiful, beautiful shade, I'm taking that. And now this is gonna go onto the face a little bit more freely. And when I'm doing this, I'm gonna begin to do the three onto the skin. This is just adding a little bit of that bronzer love all throughout. So next up, we're gonna be going into the highlighting phase and we're pretty much gonna hit the high points of the face. We got a little C area right here. You could do a little bit down the bridge of the nose, a little bit through the centers of the lip, a little bit on the cupid's bow, wherever you wanna add a little extra drama. All right, so we're gonna be taking the lighter highlighting shade and I'm gonna pop that on the high points of the cheek. So right through this area right here. And then I'm gonna take that second shimmer bronze and I'm gonna pop that a little bit closer down into that cheek. It's really just gonna play up that cheek a little bit more. We're using two different shades just to add a little bit more drama. And you could also go into a little bit of that blusher shade. Beautiful, beautiful matte blush. And I'm picking up a little bit of that and I'm running that through the cheeks. Again, when you smile, you're able to really see where that cheek sits, where you wanna place that color. And I love to go back and forth with that um, highlighting bronze and the blusher to just give that, that cheek a little bit more of a dimensional look. If you wanna give it an added glow, we're gonna go into the Smashbox Halo and I'm gonna grab that beautiful, beautiful bronze powder and I'm gonna pop that right on top of my cheek because why not? All right, so lastly, line your lips with your favorite lip liner, and then we're gonna go into the Michelada Gloss. Love this. Gloss Angeles. This is a beautiful, beautiful shade. Y'all know I love my lip gloss because look how much is left in it. Do you see this? It's like completely empty. I literally use this every single day. Like it doesn't matter what your lip color is, it just like makes any lip look amazing. It looks so different in all of our three lips, but it like looks so good, doesn't it? Like I love the color, Gorgeous. like it looks like three different gloss, yeah, gloss colors, but it looks so good. And look how poppin' the lips look. So this is our completed holiday glam look from the room to the sala to the kitchen. Beautiful, beautiful products. Just really, you could create a very natural contour. You could go real extra with the bronze, glowy. Yes, Conceita 2020. That's in here. Right. Hope y'all like this. 